Yeah, I think, you know, all of the big trends that are driving more infrastructure, like AI and machine learning and edge computing, they're, they're all causing OpenStack to evolve as well, to expose things like GPUs, FPGAs. So even though there's stuff happening at higher levels, it puts new demands on the infrastructure. So that's why you see OpenStack continuing to evolve every six months. So all those those new demands uh, to, to move into the edge space and then have AI and machine learning. So it's growing like, like exponentially. Uh, and so that's that's one of the Yeah, the demands. way the way that I summarize it is I think that infrastructure is becoming more diverse and so you have to be able to do more things in your cloud and also where the infrastructure is running is becoming more distributed so you have to be able to have clouds in more places whether that's you know in a private enterprise or on the edge or more public clouds we need more public clouds yeah. so it's great to have a strong public cloud in thailand uh, but i think you know more kinds of workloads and in more locations and and so openstack has to keep expanding beyond just kind of uh, virtual machines inside of a data center, to containers, bare metal, accelerators, edge, all of these kinds of things, and that's what the community is building.